How's it going everyone? Hopefully you're doing well. Welcome back to the grind. And uh, you join me on Malinovka. Yes, yes, yes. Very, very good. Uh, we are going to start off in the most commonly blindfired bush in the game because that's how I like to play this map. And um, probably just die instantly. It is a tier 10 game, which is actually kind of nice for me. Because at least then, that way, we get to um, have more HP to deal with. And obviously more... Uh... That's a very, very aggressive play there by him. Surprised that we don't get a spot in for that. Hmm. Okay then. Now, I'm, I'm trying to have CVS as not in the correct slot. And we put optics in it. Just a test. For one game. Um, and, I don't know. Maybe it's not really working out too well. I kind of need this guy to die. I mean, he can't really push forwards anymore. So... If we maybe call out for this guy to die, he needs to die. Like he's going to end up spotting me. <laughs> it's so scary playing light tanks, man. It's so scary sometimes. I don't know why we have a 277 sitting here. He should be on the hill. Also, if you hear, like, banging or any outside noise, um, we have a storm at the moment in the UK. I think, I believe it's called, like, Storm Eunice or something like that. Um, but yeah. Bins are being flown around the place and whatnot. So, yeah, it's kind of a, a little bit mental. Definitely not really something we're used to in the UK. I believe it's like 40 mile an hour winds, I think, I have in my area. Like, it's quite fast. Am I the one spotting this guy? I am. He's very confused. This IHM knows that I'm in this bush. Where's our light tanks? We have a manticore. Oh, I guess that's... Yeah, okay. Manticore doing a good job. Like, this is all you really need to do. Just let the heavies fight on the hill. I mean, the 277 and the 114 should have been up on the hill with them, realistically. Um, to actually fight, but, you know. If this RHM can die, it's actually going to be really, really good. Go on, just... Yes, kill him. I mean, there is still potential for us to win, because we can just hold the, the forest area, and people can just snipe from it, but... I believe that I'm going to get blind shot pretty soon. Because there's only so many spots that I can actually sit. The same with the manticore, although the manticore kind of has the whole entire bush line. I can't even really run away here. Ah, this is nice and fun. Manticore killed him. Why did you fire? Why would you fire at him and not the RHM? I mean, sure, you want to confirm a kill, but... I like this guy in chat as well. The 432. I know you can't see it because it's already... No, maybe if I can zoom down. There you go. Uh, AMX and Manti do something. What exactly do you want us to do in this exact scenario here. Please explain. 
Me and the Manticore were spotting everyone over this side of the map and this side of the map. What do you want us to do? You've won the hill now. There's no one else coming down from this hill because everyone else is spotted. And we are just farming everyone that pushes now. Like, all you had to do was just relax and just kill them as and when you can. Yeah, I still spot the standard B, so we're fine. They might not think that I'm here because they killed the Manticore. And the Manticore would spot the RHM, so the RHM might have no idea at all. I mean, we have 2.2k spotting so far, so it's not the end of the world, but... <sighs> it's possible to win, but... Useless lights! Look how their scouts worked! Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we can try and kill the VZ in a second. Well, two kills, 256 damage. Very cool. to stand and be behind us now, but not much I can do about that. We get one more in. Not a lot more I can do out of that game, unfortunately. Um, yeah. Especially not fully upgraded. If I was fully upgraded, then maybe I can run away and actually do some damage, but with the stock gun, I'm not going to be able to do much. Um, yeah. All we really had to do was just hold. I mean, I don't know why, like, our top tier heavy didn't go to the hill and fight, but... There you go. And of course, we have Mr. Know-It-All. And here's 432. AMX to Nimbus, see if you get more, more damage assist. Okay. I mean, we spotted literally everything for you, but sure. What what are we meant to do? Go over to this side of the map here and just die? What do you what What more do you want? We were spotting everyone that tried to push up to here. We were spotting everyone that pushed around to here. Do you want us just to suicide and do nothing? It's a shame I don't get a premium day from this. I'd love that. 5.2k spotting, 600 damage. Like, I'm not going to reveal his real name. I'm not really too sure what else I could do in that game. I mean, the Manticore did nothing, but he was spotting them, I guess. Yeah, so the thing that I'd done was put it into here, because then we get 486 meters zoo range instead of 480. But I don't know if raw view range is going to be better than an extra 5% decrease to camo. Because the way you have to think about it is, yes, it's only... What is it? One point, yeah, 1.5% 1 extra view range. But that's another 6 meters. So it's going to devalue the camo as well. I don't know. It's a weird one. 
there was like an in-depth like deep dive on the equipment and how cvs worked against uh optics and stuff like that and how, which one you should have but i can't remember where it was and i'm not going to go dig in to try and find it um anyway yeah so our first loss lovely very very good and uh yeah we're still very very far away from the top gun <laughs> oh yes this map I like, and it's against tier 7s. Not bad. I don't know. I like this map. I like Corellia. It's a decent map. Hmm. How are we going to play this map, though? I think I'm going to shoot. I'm not going to lie. I think I'm going to actually try and get some damage here. Well, that was a uh, very, very good amount of damage you got there, Max. Well done. G saw there as well. I know the 1357 is further ahead than me, and I'm not really too worried about it. If this G saw dies. Actually, wait. I can make sure the G saw dies. AMX is in the middle. We're going to go around over to where the Skoda is to see if we can get some spotting over that side. I think that is what we are going to do. EBR over there as well. I don't think we can sit in another bush. I have a plan. This might not work. Oh, for goodness sake. Need the this EBR to die though. But he's way outside the view range. Will this work? There we go. Very good. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm bored already. It's not actually going to work that well. We're going to go and kill this CS. And incoming clip on you. Very, very nice. And the T-103 is over there as well. Wait until we get unspotted. We go back this way, so there's a little bit of the mound in between us. We spot him, he doesn't spot us because he's stunned. That might spot us. Nope, we're lucky he died just before. And now we just need to do a bit of cleaning up. Try and get a bit of damage out. And uh, the game's over, basically. Yeah, unfortunately it is just a turbo game, so not a lot we can really do about it. T103 thinks I'm going around. It's fine. I'm about to make you look stupid if you do this. Fine. I did warn you. 
Can we spot the SU? Mm, no, he's right at the very back of the map. Oh. Oh, don't go that way. Come this way. Mm. Well, that wasn't really a great game, but I suppose we get the most out of the turbo game. Well, at least we get 1.7k. Oh, man, this is going to take forever. I need 38,000. We are not going to have every single episode of me grinding this. I will play some episodes, maybe on stream or something like that, but it's going to take too long otherwise. <laughs> Without a premium account, this just takes way too long. I will still be live. Like, you can still watch it, but I'd probably do it on stream <laughs> because otherwise this is just going to take way too long. Probably as this video goes up, I'll be live and we'll play a little bit on Big Nuba just to get a little bit closer to this and then continue. Because otherwise, like, we're, we're earning literally nothing. Like, 2,000. It's just ridiculous how slow it is without a premium account. And it's like, it's just the same thing over and over and over again. It's not, it's not like we're really progressing much. Obviously, once we get the gun, then it's a different story, but... Because uh, then it's actually something new, but it's just like playing the batch at 12T at the moment. It really is. Well, we've had Malinovka, and now we have Prokhorovka. It is with two light tanks. One is an EBR 90, so I'm actually going to pull back a little bit because he's going to be probably over the, the first bit of the hill in the middle. Even though he doesn't really have great view range, um, it's still going to be annoying to deal with. And an M41 90, which again, doesn't have great camo. Um, but he does have good view range as well, so. Oh, please assassinate him. Wonderful. EBR's on the hill. I'm going to push forwards. Okay, now we're spotting this. We try and dive down into this bit here. We did spot that as well. And push forward slightly. Oh no. Really didn't want to knock that tree over, but there you go. That's fine. We're still okay. It's the only real misplay that we've made at the moment. We have CVS in the correct slot, so anyone that pushes forwards, we should be able to spot. Although pretty much everyone is to my right on my team. So I think we're just going to have to be a little bit patient as well at the same time. Don't do it, man. Please kill this guy. Such a mob it, man. Oh. Come on, kill him. He's literally running in the open. He's a one shot. Now we have to be patient and wait for the EBR. Yeah. Thanks, RNG. Over pinks. Okay.
How has no one killed this EBR? Seriously. He's coming up again. Man. I love this guy's little force field around him. If the EBR are dead, then I can play the game. But by the looks of things, I need to be the one that kills the EBR. I don't understand. I swear that went through him or something. Like my team's just dying because I can't do anything because of this EBR. It's so dumb. That's three shots that should have hit and just didn't because RNG. Thanks. But look at him. Literally playing like an idiot and he just gets away with it. Now we can actually play the game. That was way too close. There's the T-57. There's the 263. And the Pajetto. Get a nice little kill, you know. Got to make a little bit of a dent in the enemy team. And we'll put our last two shells hopefully into this guy. And ram him because it'll be funny. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh. well, that wasn't too bad. Oh look, we don't like tank four where you need to wear low <laughs> See? That's the reason that's the real reason why I rammed him and tracked him. Mm hmm Actual uh five head.
definitely uh, meant to track him. Mm -hmm. Well, overall, that was actually a pretty good session. That wasn't bad. Uh, yeah, we're averaging 2.7k spotting and a thousand, nearly a thousand damage. Um, yeah, as I said, I don't really care about like stats on this account, so it's whatever. I mean, imagine if we had a premium account though. If we had a premium account for that game, that'd be beautiful. Because <sighs> this is even with like all these boosters running as well. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. Hopefully you did enjoy it. If you did, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Come follow me on Twitch because I'll probably be playing some of the 1390. Uh, if not at the start, then maybe, you know, as we change through. Uh, at the moment, we're trying to free mark the Tiger 88, which is uh, actually kind of pretty underrated tank, to be fair. Uh, so, yeah, come and follow me on there and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a very good weekend.